So, in the last two parts of building the Maryland, I'd placed on a, the bulk of this ship, aka the larger pieces, just because those were easier, so this video is going to primarily consist of the small details that make the ship serviceable. This lifeboat rack was quite bent, so I had to remake it with paper. Now I will note that for these two parts there are photo edge coucher parts, but when my grandfather was building the kit he broke pretty much all the photo edge cranes, so I had to use the plastic ones. As for these life rafts, later on I looked at photographs of Maryland at Pearl Harbor, and there are actually two more life rafts on the tops of turret 4 and 1. The instruction sheet does not tell you this, but the kit does have the additional life rafts if you so choose to put them on. I will install them later on. I decided to take a break from Maryland and start working on its two reconnaissance aircraft. When placing them on the launcher, there is no true way for the launcher to actually hold the plane, so it's just resting on top, so it might take a few moments to fidget it around to get it to hold in place. To my surprise, the propeller shafts were actually all in one piece, you don't have to build them, but this does mean that they are much easier to break, so be very careful when sanding them down to get the sprue attachment off of them. Well, the last things to do was rigging and weathering the vessel's hull. If you have enjoyed this build, why not subscribe and leave a comment down below, and have a wonderful day.